Um, first up, we played against the North Coast uh, Academy of Sport. Uh, the boys came out fired up, well prepared, and uh, you can tell the adrenaline was going really well. Jumped off to an early lead with uh, full court pressure defense and just never really let them into the game and ended up winning by about 30, maybe 40 points. And uh, overall, it, everyone that stepped on the court just really performed and, and uh, just showed you know, that they were really ready to play and, and just put uh, all the efforts that we put through in training throughout the year into uh, effect on the court. Uh, well, I reckon our first game was really good. Um, we got a good win. But our second game, played good defense and pretty good offense, but in like the last five minutes, didn't execute that well, and we ended up losing by one. Oh well, you know, there's bragging rights. So even though there's no finals, you obviously you will look back on the table and see where you finished and how you went. And again, we take a lot out of that game. Um, you know, we make no excuses about the loss. Again, we didn't ex execute really well. But the, the, the one thing that we can take out of the game is we know that, that uh, from what we did say, we can play a lot better. So, uh, again, we're really looking forward to that second game against them. Um, Ollie played well, like always. Uh, Matty Baitup had a pretty good first game and a pretty good second game. And that's about it, really. Don't write yourself off, mate. You played pretty well today. Okay, I played pretty well. <laughs> um, coach both the girls games today and again first game uh, very similar to the boys game the girls came out on fire enthusiasm it would be very hard to actually play your first game didn't have to sit out and watch and, and sit around and just become really relaxed um, so we came up against Hunter in the second game um, and again we were a bit maybe a bit flat but at the same time when the crack got whipping uh, the whips got cracking. Yeah, that's the one. Uh, at the end of the game, the girls really stepped it up when they needed to, and uh, we had some uh, really solid play. Um, you know, a couple of girls really stood up defensively, but offensively as well. Uh, Hannah Terezi was quite strong for us this, uh, the first two games. Um, we had Tilly Wilson, who really ran the point really well, and then there was some strong inside play by Charlotte Zara. Uh, who uh, played really strong inside. So again, across the, uh, the the court, you know, all the girls really stepped up and when they need to, and again, two from two. So um, we're looking forward to tomorrow's games and making sure that we continue with the role. Um, just getting to know each other, hanging out, um, just making friends, really. Yeah, you, you'll find that that camaraderie that they can build is something that you take into years down the track and you can look back on the two years of Academy of Sport and realize that different people that you always have that connection with or that bond that you know you went away and again you see them out and they got the flashlights and doing playing spotlight and running around at night time just little things like that that they actually just interact with each other rather than just kind of go off and do their own things and it's quite good to see as a coach that they're not only on the court they're, they're playing well together but that off the court both men's and women's team are interacting together and, and building a strong bond